we present panoptic neural fields, a semantic and object-aware neural representation for dynamic 3D scenes. Recently neural representations like NERF have made remarkable progress in describing 3D scenes from videos. While NERF is great, it can only represent static scenes. It lacks semantic understanding and is not object-aware. In our panoptic neural field representation, the scene is decomposed into amorphous background known as stuff, and countable object instances known as things. Each object instance and the stuff background is represented by their own neural function describing its 3D shape, pose, appearance, and semantics. Together they provide a holistic understanding of the scene. Our representation produces a neural field which can be queried to obtain density, color, semantic, and instance label of any 3D point over time. We demonstrate several applications of our framework like panoptic segmentation, depth prediction, novel view synthesis, and scene editing. In our model, stuff is represented by a MLP that produces color, density, and semantic field. Each object instance is represented by an oriented bounding box track and an instance level object MLP. Our framework uses fully weight encoded, instance specific MLPs to represent each object, as shown on the left, in comparison to a traditional approach of using one shared MLP with instance specific latent codes, as shown on the right. Since each instance specific MLP only needs the capacity to describe a single object instance, they can be much smaller compared to a shared MLP. Thus our approach can be significantly faster for scenes containing multiple objects. 3D object priors are incorporated into our framework via meta-learning. We use the popular federated averaging algorithm to approximate the meta-learning process of finding a better category-specific initialization of the object MLPs. As shown here, with each outer loop, the federated averaging finds better and more generalizable weights for initializing the individual object MLPs. This category-specific learned initialization allows us to reconstruct objects with sparse and partial set of input views. As shown here, our learned initialization performs much better compared to the standard initialization, and can even reconstruct cars with just one input view. Given input RGB images, we first run off the shelf image-based methods for obtaining camera pose, object tracks, and 2D semantic segmentation. We then jointly optimize the MLP weights for both stuff and things, and object track parameters using analysis by synthesis with self-supervision from the color images and pseudo-supervision from predicted semantic segmentations. At inference time, the learned panoptic neural field representation can be queried to render outputs for tasks like panoptic segmentation and depth prediction. The representation can also be used for applications like scene editing and novel view synthesis by simply changing the camera poses and object tracks. We evaluate our method on challenging kitty sequences. Here we are showing rendered image channels like color, depth, semantic, and instance segmentations obtained by simply rendering the learnt neural representation of a kitty scene. Note that these are challenging sequences since the videos are taken from forward facing cameras and they often have very little parallax. As can be seen here, our model still reconstructs all objects with high fidelity. Panoptic neural fields offer a unified representation that allows several of the 2D scene understanding tasks to be performed seamlessly by a simple forward rendering pass. Our model is also useful for applications like scene editing. In the top we show some results where the object poses are being manipulated. In the bottom we show two edited scenes where all vehicles in the scene have been cloned to a single car by replicating its MLP parameters. We also evaluate our model on the recently released Kitty 360 dataset. Our single model outperforms other baselines for both the tasks of novel view appearance and semantic segmentation. Here we show rendered semantic segmentation and rendered depth images along novel views on a Kitty 360 scene. Note that we only use the forward-facing cameras from the dataset. As can be seen from these results, the rendered semantic segmentation are temporally consistent, which traditional image segmentation models often struggle with. Here we show results from another Kitty 360 scene. Note that our model both correctly reconstructs and segments many of the difficult thin structures like lamp posts and sign symbols. We presented an object-aware semantic neural scene representation which we call panoptic neural fields. 
Panoptic neural fields can be queried to obtain density, color, semantic, and instance label of any 3D point over time. We demonstrated that we can learn panoptic neural fields of dynamic 3D scenes from images alone. We think this work will be useful for several 3D scene understanding applications.